Before start this video, please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon. Thanks. Xpeng has officially launched its highly anticipated crossover, the G6, in China. Unveiled back in April at Auto Shanghai 2023, the G6 is Xpeng's fifth model since the brand began sales in 2018. Undoubtedly the G6 is a direct competitor to the Tesla Model Y. Both vehicles are similar in size and have CLTC ranges of over 400 miles, which correlates to around 250 miles in the real world. However, the G6 is substantially cheaper than the Model Y. While Tesla's crossover starts at 263 yen, 936 dollars, 380, the G6 has a base point of only 209 yen, 928 dollars, 940. Five versions of the G6 are available with the top-of-the-line dual-motor variant retailing at 276 yen, 938 dollars, 180. The dual-motor G6 produces 480 horsepower and can sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 3. 9 seconds. All versions of the G6 have an electronically limited top speed of 125 miles per hour. Inside the G6 has a 15-inch touchscreen powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon chipset. There's room for five adults, with the driver able to avail of Xpeng's ADAS XNGP assistance system on longer highway trips. Similar to most other assistance systems, the G6 will keep your lane and steer when required. However, Xpeng promises it will eventually be able to handle complex urban scenarios through future over-the-air updates. The Xpeng G6 will be offered in Europe at some stage later this year. Currently, Xpeng offers two models in Europe, the G9 SUV and the P7 sedan. The Chinese firm sells its EVs in Denmark, the Netherlands, Norway, and Sweden. Xpeng is expected to expand to several other European nations, such as France, in the coming months. Meanwhile, a UK entry could take place in 2025. Currently, there are no concrete plans for Xpeng to expand to the US. Chinese automakers generally struggle to get a foothold in the American market, with the only viable option usually being through a foreign subsidiary, e.g. Geely and Volvo slash Polestar. That said, brands like Xpeng and Neo could change that in the coming years, with both having solid reputations for build quality and technology. Thanks for watching. Credits to Incidives.com. Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.